What's good y'all, it's Fee finally back from vacation and I am back today with another video for you guys bringing in more Codevein tips and in today's video I'm going to be covering everything that has to do with player stats. Stats in Codevein refers to the numerical variables that define the strengths and capabilities of the player character. Stats are determined by your blood code and level. Special blood fields and weapons have bonuses for each core stat. There are three categories when it comes to the stats. Character stats, attack stats, and resistance stats. Now to start off, I'll be going over the character stats. First we have HP. Each hit you take reduces your HP. If your gauge reaches zero, you will disperse. You can restore HP via regeneration items and gifts. Stamina. Each action you take consumes stamina, besides gifts, because they require I4. If your stamina reaches zero, you cannot perform any actions. Your stamina will recover over time. Focus. You gain focus by dodging enemy attacks or by taking damage. Once your gauge fills, your stamina is replenished and you enter a focus state. i -Core. Using active gifts consume i -Core. The stronger the gifts, the more i -Core is consumed. i -Core is recovered when you strike an enemy with your weapon or block an enemy's attack. Passive gifts are active even when you run out of i -Core. Base Mobility This indicates your mobility when dodging attacks. Your mobility can either be quick, normal, or slow based on total weight. Stat Scaling Indicates the degree to which your stats affect the scaling with your equipment. The higher the degree, the greater the scaling. Strength Affects physical attack and HP. Further enhances physical attack when you equip a weapon or blood veil with high scaling. Dexterity Affects physical attack and drain rating. Further enhances physical attack with high stat scaling gear. Mind. Affects stamina, drain speed, and light gifts. Willpower. Affects elemental resistance and dark gifts. Further enhances dark gifts with high stat scaling gear. Vitality. Affects HP and physical damage reduction. Further enhances physical reduction with high stat scaling gear. Fortitude. Affects stamina and elemental resistance. Further enhances elemental resistance with high stat scaling gear. Next up, we have the attack stats. When it comes to attack stats, the main things you have to focus on are the weapon attack, weapon defense, weapon mobility, weapon weight, balance, light gift, dark gift, and drain attack. Now with drain attacks, a large amount of icor can be recovered at once by landing a drain attack on an enemy. Increasing your max i -Core will allow you to use gifts that consume more i -Core and use gifts multiple times in a row. Draining can be performed multiple ways. Hold X and you will have a charge drain attack. R1 plus X would have a combo drain. And square behind the enemy will unleash a back attack. And finally, we have the resistance stats. Now for the resistance stats, we have these that are listed here. Venom, Stun, Inhibit, Slow, Leak, Blood, Fire, Ice, and Lightning. We also have three other stats that have to do with damage reduction percent, which would be Slash damage reduction percent, Crush, and Pierce. And that brings us to the end of today's video, simply discussing everything related to the player stats. Make sure to leave a like if this video helped you in any way, and subscribe for more Code Vein content.